firefighters were demanding jobs with long hours on the clock. So fire stations across the nation and here in the low country are making some schedule changes to improve the work life balance of our firefighters and EMS personnel. And it's ultimately all in an effort to better protect you. And our Tiana Maxwell joins us live from the Central Berkeley Fire and EMS Department. So Tiana, tell us about the switch and the impact that it's having. Yeah, Shelby, Katie, fire departments are working towards lowering stress while boosting work life balance, which ultimately benefits the community. Fire departments across the country are often working 24 48 hour schedules, 24 hours on the clock and 48 hours off that are meant for recovery ahead of the next workday. The National Library of Medicine states the 24 hour work stress impacts sleep, work performance and family relationships. So departments, including some here in the low country, are swapping for the 4896 schedule. The Central Berkeley Fire Department and EMS piloted the change for six months last summer. As of January, the 48 hours on the clock and four days off off the clock became a permanent change for the department. I spoke to Colt Roy, the assistant fire chief here at Berkeley County Fire and EMS. Now nearly eight months in, Roy says the department sees less overtime and more people coming into work. Roy says employees are happier, recharged and spend more quality time with their families. When you have happy employees uh, and having a healthy work home life balance is paramount to that. But when you have happier employees, employees that are coming to work more well rested, employees that are happier with the schedule that they work, it has nothing but benefits for the department and more importantly, the community we serve. Roy says the schedule switch cost the department nothing to change since it only rearranged the working days of first responders. The schedule change is expected to stay here at Central Berkeley Fire Department as feedback and community impact have been positive. In Somerville, Tiana Maxwell, Life 5 News.